Hey guys, what's up? This is guy and in today's video, we're comparing the Pyro against the Vogue. So the Pyro made its first appearance in the Smuggler Run DLC, and the Vogue made its first appearance in the Smuggler Run DLC. So now we're going to look at the customization. So customization for the Vogue. The Vogue, you can customize the armor, the speed upgrades, which is the engine upgrades. You can change the handling, you put humming missiles on it. You can also put different liveries on it too, and you can put explosive cannons on it. And let's not forget, you can put bombs on this thing too. So now for the pyro customization, you can change the liveries, you can put engine upgrades on it, armor upgrades on it, and you can put humming missiles on it. And don't forget, both these aircrafts you can equip counter measurements, so you can put shafts, flares, and other counter measurements. Both of these aircrafts can see two people inside. Now for maneuverability, the maneuverability on these two is pretty similar, but the Pyro is still better than the Vogue. In fact, it's a good bit better than the Vogue. But the Vogue is still very good, it's still one of the best planes in the game. But in a dial fight against the Pyro, the Pyro would win the dial fight. Do not underestimate the machine guns. The machine guns are pretty powerful themselves. And the machine guns will take out nearly any other plane in a few seconds. So do not underestimate the machine guns on these planes. So now we're going to look at the speed and armor on these two planes. The Pyro is faster than the Vogue, but the armor is the same on these two aircrafts. So, do not underestimate the Vogue top speed. The Vogue may be slower than the Pyro, but the Vogue is still one of the fastest planes in the game. It's faster than the Hydra, also I tested it, and it's faster than the Hydra, I was surprised about that. And another thing, the missiles on these planes. The Pyro could shoot unlimited missiles without a reload time. It could shoot just like the Savage. But the Vogue cannot do that. The Vogue could only shoot two missiles and then need like a three second reload time. It's just like the Buzzer Rockets. So in my opinion, I prefer the Pyro because of its maneuverability and with the missiles. The missiles being unlimited like that is very easy against ground targets. So I prefer the Pyro. Now I think if you are more non-skilled pilot, if you are a pilot that's not really that good, then the Vogue is the best plane for you because it has cannons on it. But if you're a skill pilot and maneuverability is the main thing that when you're a dial fight, then you do better against the pyro. So I apologize for not uploading that much. I've been busy lately. I apologize for not uploading that much lately. And if I do kind of not sound too good on this video, I'm kind of sleepy right now. So I apologize for that too. So make sure you leave a like on this video and subscribe to the YouTube channel for more videos like this. And I'm out guys. Peace.